so we're going to start by removing this um upper trim to a trim piece here this is held by a few push pins about eight of them maybe all right let's go i'm gonna use it tool like this or slap this same thing over here you're gonna be doing this thing all around it okay same thing i retrieve all of them all right it's ready to come out here it is now we're going to put the vehicle up in the air so we can remove um start removing walk around to get the bumper off there is a few now we're going to remove the wheel liner halfway it is held by a 50 15 right here we're gonna remove all of those here those t15 up here too and there are a couple of them underneath let's take them off see i got all the boats off right now we're gonna do the same thing on the passenger side but before we do that we need to remove those boats underneath here underneath the wheel liner okay now while we're underneath the vehicle now we're gonna remove those t15 here and we're also going to take those t15 underneath here too and work our way around and remove those on the other side on the passenger side okay so maybe it's about 12 or 15 t15 we need to remove okay let's take them out all right i got all the boats off as you can see then loose sides loose so we got everything loose now we're gonna work our way on the passenger side to loosen um the wheel liner all right all right now we're going to have the wheel move push it in so we can have access to those 615 here all right let's go all right it's the, the wheel liner is loose now we're going to pop it off all right so we can have access to the bumper bolt there is a, a couple bolt holding the bumper in place and we can remove this um trim piece here all right let's go all right we got the wheel liner halfway out okay just like this and now we're going to pull this molding trim this trim piece here okay do the same thing then we're going to do the same thing on the driver's side now there it is all right we got both the liners loose so now we're gonna remove this step seven millimeter here on top so we can get so we can loosen stop loosen the bumper we're gonna use the quarter inch ratchet like this to bring the boat free just like that there it is now you can Get that side loose you guys see it we're gonna do the same thing on the driver's side now all right this is loose now let's pop the bumper off there it is now we're going to lower the vehicle and while we add it make sure that you unplug this big connector here this connector here is for the headlight um the sensors let's unplug it right now because you don't want to pull on it Okay. Are you unplug it? You pull the wet tap down and you push it. There it is. Remove it from the from the body. There it is. All right. Now we're back on top. We're gonna remove those T15 here. Let's remove those T15 here. Good. Okay. We got all the boats loose now. Now the bumper is ready to come out. You're gonna need somebody else to help me take the bumper off the vehicle because you don't want to scratch the body. Alright. We need two people to take the bumper off. Let's do this. Alright guys. Our front bumper is 